yes we don't have a lot of space but yes we can do a lot of amazing things I always dreamed having a walk-in closet I'm not even gonna lie I was one of them and I'm still one of them but when you get to live in a smaller apartment and you don't have a lot of space yes you can do magic out of it still something like that Hola, bienvenue dans la Amicana Konnichiwa Watashino Channel Oni Yoko. So, I hope you're doing fine today. This is another day, another week, and another video of me. It's still a hassle from time to time, especially if you have a lot of clothes. Before going any further, you might ask yourself, well, what I am to say, right? You know? I'm glad you asked. I'm Lady Tomo, I'm a style coach and I'm dedicated, passionate about helping creative soul women entrepreneurs just like you were watching at the moment. Help you uncover your personal style so that you can show up amazingly confident on videos and even on your life and especially right now. If you like that type of video, if you're new around here, well, you're more than welcome to subscribe to turn on the notification button so that you can be notified every single time a video comes out because there's a lot of massive value. Having a capsule wardrobe or having a wardrobe in general can have a lot of challenges having a small closet. It's not uh, for you to think about it as a hassle because I like to think there's always a solution to everything. The first thing you need to have or the first thing you need to get is a clothing rack. A clothing rack is amazing because not only it helps you showcase the pieces that you wear the most but it kind of obliges you or just pushes you to be a lot more organized because it's all public it's all visual you know what i mean so wherever you're gonna place it you're gonna see it so if there is a mess well you're gonna have to organize it personally i don't like to see messy things around me i'm not gonna wait a lot to organize all of that as you can see here i have my little clothing rack and i got it from ikea a couple of years back and what i love about this clothing rack is that i put it right at the entrance i can put all the jackets that i usually wear the most if you still need to go out and work that you can clean up your outfit for the week and then put them visually there you can find a lot of great prices through amazon ikea is a great place as well there's a couple that could be a next level type of technological thing here but you have a lot of options i'm gonna have a couple of options down below the second thing is to add a couple of storage under the clothes so when you have a small closet you still have under the clothes a space that could be potentially used you can get yourself a shoe rack or a dresser above and you can get to organize them in a way where you use the top of the dresser as a place where you can put the hats where you can put accessories and then inside the dresser you can put anything to a laundry you don't want the public to see obviously and then you have the shoe rack when you can get the extra shoes or the shoes that you wear the most a couple of little accessories that you can add to clear shoe boxes instead of having a shoe rack because you then are able to add up even more boxes if you have more shoes instead of having a shoe rack that actually permits you to have a couple of shoes and maybe not all of the shoes that you want to showcase in your small closet you can add would be the motion lights that's the second accessory that i think would be amazing especially if you have a lot of clothes and you want to be able to see them <laughs> visually see them and all the things that i'm talking about i'm gonna link them down below even if your place is a little bit more darker if it's in the basement and you don't have much light that could be a game changer for you. I think it would be some clothing rack dividers and great when it comes to categorizing your pieces. I talked about it. The other thing could be to install some sliding doors. Because if your closet is in a place or a spot in your apartment where it's like in a corner, having the doors that open could be super, super duper annoying. YouTube is there for a reason. Google is here for a reason. Everything that you're looking for is literally already online on the internet somewhere. So this could be a great project for you because we all stuck at home building up and have fun with it because you not only it's gonna be customized on preferences but you're gonna be able to keep yourself busy if you feel like you are overwhelmed by everything that's happening outside right? next get some shelf dividers and instead of piling them up any type of sweater or any type of thing that you want to organize there you can use basket where you can roll up your pieces instead of folding them because by rolling them up it actually gets you to have a lot more space and a lot more room to put a lot more pieces a technique that i discovered years ago when i was traveling what i love about the shelf divider so is that you can keep your stacks intact get to pile them against on the sides so that you don't fall down when the pile is too high what i think would be to hang on your accessories as you can see here that's something that i do a lot because 
I don't have a lot of space. You can place your outfits and then place any accessories that you want to combine them with next to them so that visually you know they go together because you planned it that way. The same thing goes with the bags for example. So any little bags like that you can still get to hang them. And the bonus tip here is that anything or any handle will not get misshaped. You have that to protect them. So any scarf, any belt, any bags, any hats, any extra accessory could be hang on. way to get to see your outfits in a way where you know you can combine everything that you put there together. Next could be to double up. It could come to be easy when you get to just add another board to your closet. Which could be even better if they have hooks on the sides for the maximum versatility that you're looking for. So Amazon is amazing for that. The next thing here could be to repurposing your office supplies. Think about magazine files for example where you can store your clutches, your wristlets, your accessories on your desk table so that it can free up the space and having more space in your closet to put anything else. So anything that you can reuse, the magazine files for you to be much more creative. And Pinterest is great when you're looking for any type of inspiration like that or any type of decor. Obviously big bins that you can use to actually store a lot more shoes without having you to buy anything extra. Think about a way to use the space where you can do a lot and repurpose everything that I talked about before. Again, careful here, you don't want to put way too many things in a small space, feeling like this, way too many things and you feeling overwhelmed because of it. So get creative. Get creative with anything you have in your space, your small closet, your apartment in general. My living room, I have hats on both sides of my TV and it's super 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 duper cute. There's a way to do it there that I did in my living room to make your space feel you and authentic at the same time getting more organized even if you have a small closet. I hope it inspired you, I hope it helped you. Let me know how you organize your smaller space and if you have any type of challenge when it comes to it and if those tips actually help you or motivate you to work on those small spaces and closets even more now. Of course don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button so that you can know every single time that I have a video out there because there's always a lot of nice value especially right now when we all are stuck at home follow me on instagram because well i'm getting even more creative with confidence boost and any type of outfit inspiration have more access to me in the dm so i hope it helps you i'm gonna see you on my next video and like i say all the time smile because it's free and contagious bye